the pass inwards towards Rettles, but just too far ahead of his team captain there. Garrett will find a clear. Gyro drops it down. Both of his teammates is around the ball. Rettles will pick it up as energy gives him space. And actually, does he bump Justin? What happened here? Rettles puts the ball that in. That was a nasty bump from Rettles. He gets the first touch here and goes straight for the oh. bump on Justin. And the heavy lifting from Rettles continues. Still lost. They've got a lot of work ahead of them. AJ has a read on Turbo, and now Justin over to Garrett. The shot from midfield, just off the crossbar, back down and good. Garrett ties the game. Garrett putting this one bar down off a lovely touch from Justin. And he had to come in, and it looked like he might have had to finish that one off. It was bouncing right on the goal. NRG will hold on. But I love that effort from the Knights, especially AJ getting that center ball. We see him trying to do that again. Oh. But a good oh, play Garrett from Garrett G. and oh. Turbo. What a turbo pull shot Garrett into this. Look at this, look at this catch from Garrett just to get it past AJ. Beautiful stuff. And then you're right, Turbo comes up, bumps Garrett, adds some more <laughs> speed to it, and energy's got the lead. So so does that that This playing it close is gonna be good enough that they can just find a single crack in the armor. It's Rettles coming back down, Justin. An extension over two. That one's just in, though. The crack in the armor comes on the side of the Knights. And that's 3-1 for NRG. Justin getting there first. AJ cheated up. He was getting a little greedy, which is understandable. You're approaching the final minute. By the time he did, Justin had this shot. It was too late. And AJ just had to watch it go in. Oh, Justin looking for the double tap. And it goes in. You're kidding me. Off the defender and back out. Justin styling on him. And Garrett G with the setup as well, but look at that high speed <laughs> double tap. AJ thought he was in position to stop it. He wasn't expecting that perfect of a shot from Justin. And that is why you do free training. That is why you do the training packs, get those reps in so you can make shots no. like that. And Justin getting another one for the road. The kickoff goal, Justin. Getting the change up on Gyro and Net here. He thought he had it red. Justin just changes it at the last moment off to the edge. 46 seconds left, and this game's over, James. And you've already given him too much, so <laughs> at this point, NRG feeling pretty strong. That game easily going to be theirs. And for the Knights, it's time to go back to the drawing board a bit. But if you haven't figured it out during the week, it's, it's I, I wonder if the next 60 seconds is going to be enough. They do a good job respecting the rules of Rocket League, keeping the ball in the air as long as possible. Here, can they actually get another goal for the road? No, it gets bumped away. And finally, NRG will take their win up by four. And despite the scoreline being very low, Eric does get enough of a stop. Well done. The Knights hold on and will stay scoreless as we approach halftime. And now we're seeing multiple demos, but oh. all the flip reset oh. from Justin <laughs> cutting me off with a clip. Yet again, that first touch, it even bounces off the ceiling. He had one boost left in the tank when he gets his flip reset. He used it up. Ground and back out. And they'll keep the goal at one, but Knight still struggling to find a real good, strong offensive presence as Turbo will finally find a hole and it goes in. Reddle's best effort is not enough. Turbo, this shot off the pass from Garrett. Garrett has been doing this quite a bit. You have to give Garrett credit for setting his teammates up so well, lofting the ball up so that they can do the something out unless they do something different. They are really with their backs against the wall at this point. Gyro, AJ takes a shot, finally! He's been shooting for that corner every single time, finally gets it into the corner and it's good for the Knights' first goal. And there's that something different I was looking for. You see Gyro gets called off. AJ calls him off so that he can take the shot and AJ in the field, but now taking the shot himself and it's exactly what the Knights needed and now they're within striking distance. Now the creativity on that goal as they find another one, Rettles finds the zero degree from the corner and we're all tied up. And the, the Knights wake up. Rettles, the slow play, you saw him play Justin in the corner. He lets the ball bounce there, but Turbo shots him down, nearly finds him on the far side. Garrett G's shot is denied by Rettles. End to end, goalpost to goalpost we go as Rettles back down to AJ. This one for the win, off the ball, oh, all oh, the woodwork and in. AJ's shot again goes through. 
This was a roller coaster of emotions from both sides. It looked like Gyro was going to score. Then it goes all the way downfield. It looks like Turbo might be able to make uh, take advantage of it. Looking to tie up the series. Turbo through the air, loses control of the ball. AJ's not got the best touch, but it's back to Gyro. Can Justin find a way to turn this one around? Keeps it up, but no. AJ will push it to the ground. Knights come alive in the final minute and tie up the series. The, the Knights just needed a little bit of all guns firing in game one. So many series this season. And then dropped game number two. Can they bounce back here, though? Turbo looks for the drop down by himself. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe so much interference. And he makes this shot work. I don't know how Turbo does this. He gets the triple tap. He gets bumped. Then he goes then he goes for net still. He got bumped and hit his head. Touch the defense now all high. Could Justin recover from this? Nearly finds the shot. But no, Gyro able to guide it off to safety in the corner. Now Turbo pulls it and finally it goes through. So much pressure from Knights. And the defense from the, or so much pressure from NRG here to score the second and, goal. And look at what Garrett does. He jumps in the path of AJ. I don't know if you caught that. He knew AJ needed to go up for the ball. And now the pinch back across. Gary G will turn in quickly. Force the block out of Gyro. Now through two. Turbo pulls it. Looking for the setup. Gets it across. Gary G's airborne. Tucks it in and pushes it down for goal number three. Justin and or Garrett and Turbo have been doing everything so far this game. Turbo with that little flick gets it above Gyro. Garrett will put this in. Justin has all he's had to do is point for the Knights in this game. However, it's mostly due to NRG just bringing the heat. And that shot, oh, oh that little oh. touch from AJ was something else. We'll take another look at it on the replay. AJ saw that Justin was in net and he flips and gets the lightest touch. Justin was gonna get the- Game number three. It looked like maybe game three would play out like game two with NRG getting out to those early lead and then seeing the revitalization, but no, it has been all NRG in game three. Turbo getting this final goal from wall to wall. <laughs> wow. Just the it trebuchet. Once, so. <laughs> he got it all he, he, his, he was literally his all four of his wheels were on his back wall when he made that shot two seconds left this game just a formality at this point as they'll bring it down to the end how long can they keep the ball in the air this time they and that's a hat trick the... for turbo and, and honestly oh, way punk oh, it's oh, not oh, useless oh. even though we see a a constellation goal but for turbo he's in the hunt for golden striker so every goal counts and we've seen it even in previous seasons where an entire race can come down to a single goal. Well, we've seen we've seen races come down to a single game back in season. And Reynolds was stuck in the net on zero boost. He was going for bumps when he had nothing in the tank. Now this is looking good for them as Reynolds has a lot of boost, some space, the infield Ooh. pass, the shot. AJ getting the Knights their first goal. And what a way to do it. And such an important first goal, too. A beautiful infield pass breaks up the defense and paves the way for that. Puts it high. Gyro stretches for this. Gets just enough of a touch to put it over the top of Garrett G. Turbo pulls it into the corner. Justin on this back wall. The fall from Turbo. Justin, I'm not sure where he was, where, what he was reading here as the net's wide open for Knights. Justin, it looked like he wanted to go on the back wall. He had no boost. And when you have no boost, midfield with 120 left to go, NRG yet to score in game four, and a loss here would send us to a decisive game five. Treadles through one, through two, and in. That's three goals now for Knights. They're looking to run away with it here. And then we saw the the accidental bump. Garrett respawned right there. It looked like Turbo wasn't able to rotate and get the save. And Knights. Would you, would you believe it? They come back in game four, and this was this was a, a resounding win. Very one-sided in favor of the Knights, and that's going to have them feeling fantastic going into game five. Some absolutely beautiful goals, a few defensive punishes, and NRG kept quiet here. Can they find a way back in? As Turbo will find oh. one. That's the beginning of the road to come back, but they've got to find two more. Yeah, that was, I mean, maybe I'm calling it too early, but a three goal lead with under a minute left to go, that would be something else. However, Turbo keeps the hole. As they try to get it all the way down, but AJ's got so much space just to push it to the corner. And with zero seconds left, 
it's impossible for the win to go their way. And that'll be game four going to the Knights. Game five inbound, James. We've got a series on our hands. And can we talk about that save? Gyro's up, AJ, and tries to place it to the uh, to the edge, that corner. But no good. Garrett G now through one, up against two. Reynolds touches just neutral enough, but Justin closes the gap. Now off the backboard, the touches from Justin are in. He scores it here in the game five. Can this be all they need? Can you believe this shot? What? A triple tap from Justin in game five. Eight seconds left. Justin to Garrett, into the corner. AJ doesn't have anything waiting on a teammate, but there's nobody there. He's got to do it himself. Half a tank of boost to work with. Through the air, into this corner. All is it dead? Justin over the edge. Reynolds, no, and it's off to the backside. No one's there to touch it and keep it up. NRG have to fight so hard, but they vanquish the Knights and take it in five.